Greetings, comrades. This is over here in Caleb. Back with another HD VR video. I'm kind of not on a roll with the VR videos lately. I guess I'm just uh, getting more and more used to the HTC Vive and just <laughs> how much better it is compared to the Rift S. So, uh, still working on uh, finding a comfortable fit for this thing. At least I'm taking off my glasses. So, uh, it's easier, easier for me to flip the visor off and up. Yeah. Anyway, Another update, update 108. It's a rather small one. Honestly, there's not much to it. Just adds two new weapons, two joke weapons, I might add. And uh, let's see if they're on here. Well, actually, we just checked the uh, tag search mode. Update 108. Yeah, we have only two new weapons, and uh, pretty interesting if you saw the dev vlog the other day. Well, yesterday, I should say. We have the MP5 Shadow. Now, it doesn't look too bad at first, you know. Just look at your regular MP5. Go, uh, yeah. Single, you know, semi auto. Use the same magazines. Go, uh, huh. I can't. I mean, I can't do the, uh, I think... Oh, okay, okay. Now I remember. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have a pump action MP5. And the uh, fire sucker's not wrong. You had to put it on safe to fire. I'm not sure if that's intentional or not. I don't think it was. Oh, Anton, the wonderful joys you give us all. Yeah, I want to say about that. A pump action MP5. Never, you haven't lived until you took one of uh, Germany's uh, most well known submachine guns and uh, turn it into a, an impromptu Mossberg 590. See, so yeah, does that. But the next one, oh boy. You saw the devlog, you know what we're about to get into. This, comrades. Rail Tater. This is inspired by a YouTuber called Commander Carl, who's known for like uh, wacky reloads of like everyday objects and whatnot. I honestly haven't seen it myself. I might check about it after this, actually. And uh, this thing is a rail gun. Not just any rail gun. A rail gun that fires Pringles. These Pringles do well. We're about to find out, comrades. Just put it in there, put it there, and deliver a punch that only a Pringles chip can offer. Very interesting. Now, what's interesting, the handles right here, you hold the uh, over up here. Why you hold it? This is kind of awkward. Maybe not the most bizarre weapon I've seen in this game, but uh, pretty close to it. Talking about a railgun that fires potato chips. Porkless. Hot dog. Okay, so he's vegan too, okay? I wasn't aware of that. So you know we're about to brass cartridges here. It's all potato chips. Traveling at the speed of light, it seems. Very interesting. Let's see how to handle these targets over here. Does they even leave a bullet? It does. Size one. Not bad for a little potato crisp you get out of a can. You fart one handed. You can, but uh, it's not ideal. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Yep, we have a rather interesting uh, pair of weapons here, comrades. 
Again, not the most bizarre things I've seen, but uh, definitely up there. I mean, pump action MP5 with an incorrect fire selector and a railgun that shoots potato chips. You know. You know. I guess it's the idea, not the execution. But yeah. Pretty short video today, comrades. Just uh, thought I'd get a video out there. And uh, just give me an opportunity to goof around the HTC Vive. And uh, I kind of wish it had like a special tool so you could like turn with the right thumb, uh, thumb pad and move the left. You can move with the left thumb pad, but it'd be nice if you can like turn stuff and uh, like physically turn off. Especially for those with small spaces. And like, uh, you know, people just don't want to keep turning on so much and probably risk. Uh, Really tangling up their cord, unless you have a wireless adapter to provide, in which case, knock yourself out. That might get one of those one of these days, but it's like 350 bucks. Jesus. It'd be quite an investment, but then again, this was an investment in and of itself. Worthwhile investment. Anyway, this is I'm Gonna Caleb signing out. Have a good day. What, you said something like April Fool's joke? Nah, all those jokes are too obvious. No. You hear about Sonic the Hedgehog dying? Oh man. Very gruesome. Gruesome. I saw the footage. It was like. Oh man, don't. Uh, don't tell your kids about it. Just uh, tell them that uh, he's pursuing greater things now. Catching rings in the sky. Yeah, that's obviously fake, though. Uh, hey, because of later games, he's kind of coming back to life.